What's up guys, if you want cheap, fast, and reliable MT, and you want to get those spotlight challenges done, hit up my new sponsor DVDJ and use code YOURBOYBUGS for 10% off a checkout. And yeah man, check them out. What's good guys, if you want cheap, fast, and reliable NBA 2K20 My Team coins, head on over to NBAsafe.com and use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout. What's good YouTube, it's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K20 My Team video, and guys, today, we're going to go over the market. Now, in this video, um, it's very late at night. It is pre-recorded. The Opal Kawhi and the Giannis are dropping soon. But yeah, I'm going to go over the market and tell you guys what you should be doing and whatnot. Um, if you guys get this video to 100 likes, that would be greatly appreciated, man. We are going to go over everything in this video and what has been going down with the market. The market is completely crashed. And honestly, this could be the last day it crashes. So, man, we got a lot to talk about. First off, I just saw Tracy McGrady sell for 200K. He's back up to 300. I don't know what's going on with that. But that's something I, that caught my eye, and I was like, how is that even possible? Also, the Galaxy Opal Kawhi, it is 1230 Eastern where I am. I'm waiting for that to drop. I can't believe it's a Galaxy Opal, and they dropped the 98 Giannis. So personally, I will be getting myself a Giannis. I'll try to be getting the Kawhi, and the 96 Chris Paul is going to be really good itself. So now, I don't know what I want to do. Do I get Glitch LeBron? I don't know. I have 400K. I can get some more MT stacked up. But uh, yeah, I'm really confused, but forget that, okay? Right now, we got the Aaron Gordon is probably going to be under 100K. I mean, he was just at 140K earlier. He's back up to 230. It is late at night. But with these packs dropping, the market's going to crash even more. So Monday morning might be a really good time to pick up all your cards that you want. And uh, things should start going up around Wednesday. So that's also something that should happen. Right now, it's kind of crazy how crashed the market is. Everything's going to go up. It's just going to take some time. You really got to be patient. Like, they shouldn't drop content until I would say probably, I would say probably Thursday, Friday. They shouldn't even drop content Thursday because, dude, if they drop anything, the market's going to crash. I'm expecting a spotlight series, which really wouldn't cr um, crash the market and also a prime too. So, I don't know though. But, yeah, let's get into some market, man. Let's talk about it. So, um, right now, what you guys should be doing, honestly, if you really want to pick up an Opal, now is the time. Right when this Kawhi and Giannis drops, I would sit on the filter for sure. Um, this, Those two cars are going to break the market. Everyone's going to try to pull Giannis. And now they have another Galaxy Opal in the game, which is actually insane. Like, Galaxy Opal, Kawhi, Leonard? Are you kidding me? So, I'm waiting for this to drop. Supposedly, it might drop at 1 Eastern. It's like 12.30 Eastern right now. So hopefully they do drop something right now. What you guys should be doing, honestly, try to stock up on diamond cards. I would recommend it. Like diamond cards are really, really good to stack, especially if you don't have that much MT. If you have like 100K MT, try to stack up on diamond cards right now. There's so many things you guys should be doing in this game. Um, I started talking low. It's really late, um, like really late. I have work at 6.45 in the morning, so I'm going to get like a five hour sleep. But it's, it's okay. It's worth the grind, honestly. So um, some cards I was talking about was Steve Nash. And with him being this cheap, I think he's a must-cop at this point. Honestly, even if you have a God Squad, you could throw in Steve Nash some games. He's actually a pretty solid card. I would recommend picking him up. I have him on my squad. And for the price of 16 k man, he's going to probably be 15 k any second. So I'm going to try to sign him out for 15 k It is a 90-something overall diamond, so... Honestly, he should go up to around 30-ish K, in my opinion. I don't know, though. He's very... Oh, right there. 14K. Give me that. <sighs> Missed it. So, yeah. This this Steve Nash filter actually might be really, really good. If you have, like, 100K or 50K sitting there, this Steve Nash filter can make you thousands of MT in seconds. So, I would definitely recommend trying to stack this card out. Also, if you want Tracy McGrady, now's the time to get him. If you want Galaxy Oval MJ, now's the time to get him. They're going to go up in value. There's not that much time left in the packs for Galaxy Oval Vince Carter and Galaxy Oval MJ. Also, man, Pink Diamond Glitch LeBron. This is probably your last day you could get him, man. He's not going to be in packs for that much longer. He's super, super rare. As you guys know, the glitch cards are always that rare. So I might have to pick up a LeBron before I go to bed. Also, man, if you have Magic Johnson, if you have Bird, please hold on to them. Do not sell these cards. They're very valuable. They're actually goaded. My Larry Bird greens every shot. And honestly, bro, I don't think I could play a my team game without him. He's one of my favorite, favorite players in this game. He is a automatic green. For all you that are heaping Hakeems, for all you that have Bosh, 
Hakeem, Tim Duncan. I would literally wait. Like, the market is so flooded right now. And not only that, bro. Like, I don't even know what to say. The market's so dead. And right now, man, you can pretty much do anything. All I'm going to say is that if you have millions of MT and a hundred thousands of MT, just spend all of it. Like, literally blow up everything. Just get on the market and buy anything you see that's a reasonable price. Like, Kobe Bryant Diamond, I feel, is a really cheap price, bro. They have no other Kobe's in the game. They haven't released the locker code yet. I really feel like if you could get Kobe Bryant Diamond for like 50k, he could go up to 80, maybe even 100k. There's still not a lot of him in the game. So like he might be one really good card on target. Also some spotlight cards. Like Kobe's literally 48k with a diamond contract. So I don't understand that. I'm actually going to pick that up right now. Um, that's stupid cheap for Kobe, man. 48k for Diamond Kobe. So I just picked that up. He had a diamond contract. He should be going up to at least 60k by like tomorrow. So that is a W for me. Vince Carter, I would try recommend Diamond Vince Carter. Try to snipe him out. Um, some spotlight cards, maybe Oscar Robertson. Spotlight cards are still a thing, man. Kids are still trying to do these spotlight challenges. You have to think about how many kids are behind. I was behind, but I caught up. So if you want, try sniping out Oscar Robertson's. You pretty much want to snipe out the cards that have value. Like I only I chose Kobe because, bro, it's Kobe. He has so much value. Everybody wants Diamond Kobe. And if you're a budget baller, he's actually so, so good. Like I literally start him in my God squad. This is my squad. It's pretty stacked. It's really not my squad, but this is what I have down here. Millsap, Richard Jefferson, Reggie Lou. My team's pretty damn stacked. I'm trying to get Lynn to a pink diamond. But, yo, right now, I don't even know what to say. Let's see if they drop. Yeah, they still haven't dropped the cards. They should be dropping soon. But uh, let's see if they did drop the stats yet for you guys. Yeah, they still haven't dropped the stats. Waiting for Shake and Bake to tweet those out. They should be coming out any second. But, yeah, right now... Also, if you guys want to pick up BAM, all those cards are actually out for 12 days. So, I would wait possibly to like midday today. Um, yeah, pretty much. Uh, BAM, I would die. I was going for like 200k. Now, he is a buyout. So, that's kind of cool. He's really a top center in the game. Like, literally, I don't know how he's a top center in the game, but he is. But he heals really good. There's a lot of cards you should be, t you should be targeting right now. And also, man, if you guys don't know these snipe filters, you probably should. Try out Galaxy Oval buyout. Try out glitched buyout. If you get a glitched buyout, man, oh my god. You get Ben Simmons, J.R. Smith, or LeBron in this filter. If you get any of those, GG's, man. Um, and I was just watching Logic. He just sniped out Vince Carter for 100k, man. I, I still haven't seen like any snipe since the first day they dropped. But, man, I'm waiting for one. I'm simply just waiting for one. There's just so many empty methods in the game. I would recommend investing in Chauncey Billups, Steve Nash, Shaxx, whatever you want. It depends on your MT. Personally, if you have 500k MT, throw up, try to get like 100 Chauncey Billups. Like literally, if you get 100 Chauncey Billups for 5k or 4k and sell them for like 8k a couple like a week later, you're going to make 3k profit. Three times 100 is 300,000 profit and he'll sell quick. So, yeah, I said that a couple for 4K. He's already at 5K. This is a very good card to snipe. Steve Nash is a guard, good card to snipe. Also, Diamond Moments Heat is a really good filter. I missed one BAM for 40K yesterday. I really don't want to talk about it. But, uh, yeah, I did miss a BAM for 40,000 MT on this filter. You could get Derek Jones Jr. for the low. I don't know why it's lagging. Oh, I didn't go to Heat. Um, you got to go Heat, Diamond Moments. And yeah, this filter is pretty deadly. Bam on the dial. If he pops off for the low, that's a W if you get him. Oh, I don't know if that's a snipe. I don't think it is. I think I might have just lost MT. All right. Actually, I'm going to sell him quick. He's 45K MT. I'll take that dub real quick. I'll make like 1K profit. Hopefully, he sells right away because I do have not that much MT left. I just sold like 90,000 MT in shoes trying to get my MT back up. But uh, yeah, as you can see, I hopped in that filter for one second. I honestly think he should go for a little more than 40k. But yeah, I took a quick dub. And yeah, that's really all I got. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please drop a sub, drop a like, all that good stuff. Hope you guys enjoy some methods for you. If you have any questions on methods, just let me know down below. Any questions in general, just let me know down below. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Have a good one. Peace.